welcome. Um, my name is um, Magpie Johnson. And yes, I do have a story about that because um, everyone asks. Now I am. Um, I know you all came to hear songs tonight and singing and dancing, right? The singing and dancing man. Well, <clears throat> well, I'm afraid I first have to break some bad news to you. I, um, my drummer, he, he got into a car accident and busted his tail light, broke his pinky finger, had to rush to the hospital, rush to the mechanic, get stitched up, fixed up. Um, so he, he's running a bit late, and um, also my... Um, my bass player, he just got dumped by his girlfriend of two and a half months. Um, so he's in, in another bar, or, or at home in the tub, actually, I'm, I'm not sure. Um, but, but crying his eyes out, um, either way. And, and my water phone player, she's at home fixing a leaky faucet um, so the place doesn't flood um, after the show she don't she doesn't want to come home to to um, well, water water everywhere so uh, uh, let's all have a drink right I do have a thing for you know, shiny, shiny objects, I guess. Um, I don't know. A lot of people, I don't know about that. Well, I, I love shiny objects, but it's really not like that. It's not like I'm you know, hunt everywhere around for them and you know, kind of bury them in my nest, though. At the end of the show, I uh, was planning. 
planning on, you know, passing the hat around uh, you find people and you know if you feel the urge to toss in a, uh, toss in a silver coin or or something like that you you're most welcome to do that really that smoke another cigarette hold on even tighter to the hem of your garment sniff your hair and another memory in the pocket in the borders between abuse and dependent you're a liquid there's one more cup of coffee and I'm ready to say goodbye sit in the dark with the highway as my only goal with the past still rolling through 
my veins and lungs and senses and there to remain until the next catastrophe, the next traffic jam in my wake, and the next dependence. And perhaps even longer, but I pray for mercy. Just one more cup of coffee, and then I'm gone. Hmm. There's um there's a melody somewhere in there, I'm sure of it. I just haven't really found it yet. Hmm. A rhythm perhaps, um some sort of cadence. Hmm. Maybe uh maybe later tonight I'll Give it another shot. Just hang me, oh, hang me, wouldn't mind hanging, but, but the laying on the ground, that's it, no, no I am, let's do another story, you know I am, I met this, um, met this girl once in a place just like this and quite some time ago a couple of years i think um came up to me after the show and asked can i bum her a cigarette and you know sure she could and we spent all night on the, on the bench here she was uh all the way up there on the c sharp and i was all the way down here on the on the G flat, and you know, in some manner of speaking, we're we're right there, but still so far apart. And God help me, I couldn't think of a single chord. That's where I needed the inspiration, and that's where it failed me. Where do I get my inspiration? Oh, there's an original question. Uh, well, I don't know, all over the place, I guess. Uh, uh, street walks, the windows, the uh, ladies and the gents, the sky above, the uh, ground below. No, uh, really, well, where does anyone get their inspiration from? Uh, the lived experience, you know. I worked uh, worked as a fireman once, a uh, butcher's boy, upholsterer, newspaper boy, teacher's assistant, uh, you know. Once I even had a brief career in air conditioning and refrigeration. No, it didn't pan out. I decided I'd rather sing. Earn my living that way. No, I don't know how well that's going, but there you go. I lived in a, in a camper van for, for several years too. So, you no. Know, anyway, where was I even? Um, right, right, right. The the girl, um, the girl, and inspiration. You know. Writing songs is a uh, is one thing. You know, sitting on the keys, uh, but uh, being out there in, in the real world—that's um, that's quite quite another 
another thing, another undertaking, um, you know, conversing. <laughs> uh, it's not exactly my my strong suit. Um, you know, more comfortable with the, with the keys and the words, really. Um, um, no, I um, I met the actual devil once. Actually, once um, you know, a place not not unlike this, very um, very seedy, very very appropriate. Yeah, um, you know, that nice fellow too. Um, you know, he, he uh, invited me for a drink and wanted me to stay longer. You know, I I declined. Um, well, we had this uh, on this big, um, dusty, black coat. Uh, never took it off, but you know, some say that beneath the coat there, there are wings. And others say that beneath the coat, that's where he has his, his red right hand. Uh, deliver justice or injustice, whatever, well, no, yeah. well, I don't know, talking about inspiration, you know, I am, I, I made a pact with a Robert Johnson too, oh, that guy could play, that guy could play, yeah. oh, let's, um, let's hold off on the keys, just, um, uh, no, give the, Give the guys a few more moments to um to get here. You know, writing songs. So, you know, that's his own kind of a penetrating magic. You know, it's scary sometimes too. You know, you know one time writing a writing a song, I I thought I heard a a ghost in the piano. Yeah, I thought I heard someone. No screaming down there, but um, no. Then I stick my head inside, and it's all strings and hammers. No life. Maybe uh, a rat or two. A bouquet of wilted flowers. You know, that's all the love I've ever spent on someone else. All for nothing. You know? No, that's that's not all I've done. You know? There, that's a lesson, I guess. Tell your, tell your children not to do what I've done. And that's for sure. Um, well, no, in that vein, I guess. Um, why don't we, um, how about a children's story? A nice bedtime story? Do you like that? No, maybe, um, well, I don't know if we'll end on, on that note, but um, let's hold off on the keys. I'll just tell you the story. Uh, uh, cheers. Uh, yeah. So, once upon a time, there was a little girl. Her parents were dead. And... She was all alone. She was taking care of her, her brothers, and sisters, and all day she was working to provide for them. Inside, she was full of dreams. She wanted to become an actress. She wanted to become a singer. She wanted to become a dancer. She wanted to travel the world and be a star and live life of her dreams and so she went out into the world and first she met an old lady in a flowing red dress and the lady asked the little girl to sing a song or dance a dance and she danced her heart out she better believe but when she'd given it her all the lady turned her nose at her and, and walked away and so the girl went on her way and met a stern man in a suit and asked her to sing a song, dance a dance, and she sang a song the most beautiful, heartbreaking.
heartbreaking song of herself. The man, he, he turned on his heels and he walked away. And then, and then finally she went to the theater and auditioned and she wore a costume. She painted her face, her eyes. She changed her voice and lied about her name. And finally, she got her chance. She got her applause. She got cheers. She got roses for lying to the world and to herself. And she continued through the years, night after night. She veiled herself on stage. Finally, the center of attention. Finally, a shining star, a ball of light. But really, there was a center of black nothingness, black hole, an explosion, a destruction, zooming through space for all to look at, but when in reality she was already dead and gone. There. That's your story. Night, night. In some ways, I think I am. I think I am that little girl. Except my uh, star doesn't burn as bright as hers, unfortunately. I'm not going to go out with a bang, but with a whimper. And uh, uh, fizz out and... Uh, and the black nothingness and the unknown, the unknown void. And that will be the end of me. Well, that's uplifting. Well, and still I'm here. All alone. They're gonna show up even. Maybe um maybe it's time we just got on with the show. Shall we? What do you say? Yeah. Yeah. Let's do that. Let's treat those keys to some really special. Okay. Now, this first one. <laughs>